a good chance. Please, guys, you got a book. There's water. We got it. And it clicks on. Yeah. You ready to go on a car ride? Today's gonna be a fun day, guys. We're going to Rochester because Josh has to do his like fitting for his suit for a wedding he's in. No, it's not the fitting, it's the first try on. Try on. And then they just make their last minute alterations. And then I think we might put together Lucas's splash pad later today because it's supposed to be warm. So I'm really excited for that. And oh, there's another cardinal. Hope oh, I tried to get a video and she ran away. She flew away. She flew away. A lot of babies this time. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen babies. I can't. Oh my gosh. There's only like four the last time I saw them. Oh my god, they're so cute. Oh, baby Lucas, I wish you could see them. See, that would be like what would be fun if we had like a golf cart or whatever, just like driving around and seeing them. Because oh, then Lucas could see it more than like right now he's in his car seat, you know? Yeah. That would be fun. They're never out when we go on a walk. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess we don't walk this way usually. Because the last three times we've left, they've been right there in between those two houses. They were in our backyard a couple times. This year? Yeah, we were at work. But there was only four babies at that time. They're right to the right where the bunny rabbit was this morning. Okay. So cute. About to eat some yummy food. All right. No, There's no, my no. salad. All right, all right. Okay. My drink. Mommy's drink. I don't even remember the name of everything I got. All right. So we got mac and cheese. Orange chicken. What is this, tiki masala. Uh, I got one for Lucas. Yep. What is that, curry, cauliflower. I'm gonna cut mac this up and for cheese. you, bud. That was bacon ranch tortellini. Some mashed taters. She's got an extra one for him to eat on. Yeah, pineapple, mama salad. Yeah, I'm gonna, chicken, I'm gonna cut it for you. For man. Mm -mm -mm. today we went to Rochester and um, this place we've never been to before but it was really cute it was like a Macy's so I'm gonna show you guys what I got real quick I got some basics um, this is from Target my sister picked this up for me I just need like basic tanks and stuff we live in Michigan so I have a bunch of jackets long sleeve sweatshirts but not a lot of summer stuff so here's the Target tank it's cute um, it's a little more cropped than I would like these are just like low rise shorts so if I had high waisted shorts or pants on they'd be perfect um I've kind of been having a hard time finding things that aren't cropped which I just I don't know ever since having a baby and stuff I just I'm not like super comfortable with this area but um yeah like I said if I had some high waisted shorts they'd be perfect so that way they're not like bunched up because it's so long so this is just like a basic tank um it's actually a size large but it's like a little muscle tank. is just one of their racer backs but um so soft so buttery there's a 
Whenever we do a family walk, it's easily one of the best parts of my day. Um, it's just nice to get outside with everyone and Josh and I always have really good conversations. So I highly recommend trying this out in your routine if you can. <laughs> He's had a busy, busy day. So I got an Amazon order. Um, let's see. I was editing this video and during our walk on the last portion or whatever, Josh and I were just talking but the wind was so bad that you literally like, all you could hear was the wind um, overpowering our conversation. So I don't have that for this video but I figured I would just kind of pick it off right here and then end it. But, um, but basically he was just kind of like putting me in check and telling me that I need to stop like apologizing for my feelings and things like that or whatever. And uh, we were just talking about how like parenting is so fun and life is so fun with him and like what did we do before him. Um, like seriously, what was life before kids? It's just crazy. Um, but it's really nice right now because I got the baby monitor here or whatever, but, um, he's like pretty much taking two naps a day now and they're around the same time, depending like if he wakes up at five or six or whatever, but it's just so nice to have the like reliability or like the structure of that, like whatever, but, um, yeah, it's just so nice. So, and then now it's like, oh, okay, maybe we can have another kid. <laughs> <laughs> now that things are finally back to normal after like um 11 months but it's so funny yesterday we were outside playing um on the tarp or whatever like under the tree and i was like oh my gosh luca this is seriously 11 months today like what like and that just really threw me for a loop because like i already have his first birthday invitations like sent out and i'm already starting to plan it but just the fact that i'm like in 30 days you're gonna be one year we're gonna have a toddler i just it's i don't know it feels more real with him at 11 months than it did with him at 10 months obviously because it's like seriously in grasping distance now but it's just wild because i still feel like i just had him and i can just like I, it's just it's just so weird and I just think is this how the rest of my life is gonna be you know just like he obviously he's just getting bigger and bigger but it's just crazy you guys it's crazy life's crazy like time goes by way too fast so it's just wild and here I am babbling again so anyways let's get back to it and let's open up this Amazon thing it's just like a random stuff I needed some things for his birthday for up north. Oh, I hope this isn't too big. But, oh no, I really hope this isn't gonna be too big. That's 12 to 18 months though. So we have the wedding that we have to go to, or that we're going to. And so I got him, I think that'll be okay. This like really cute outfit. It's like these little pants. Which pants aren't the big, these kind of do feel a little tight. And then like this little top. And then it comes with little suspenders or whatever, but um, I mean, I know it's like, it's in a couple weeks. So he's just transitioning over to like, 18 months 12 to 18 month clothes which i've been fine with his clothes like up until now i pretty much you know had hand-me-downs or just from the baby shower like people didn't always just get newborn stuff um so i've kind of like had clothes like scattered throughout but now he's like hit the stage where i've used up pretty much all his 12 month stuff so i need to start thinking in advance for like um what the weather and stuff's going to be like at the next stages because it jumps to like 18 months and then it goes right to 24 so 
crazy. But, oh yeah, I got him this little Montessori toy thing. It's supposed to be like interactive and stuff. Um, I'm 18 months plus, but um, motor skills, sensory exploration, cause and effect, midline stuff. So yes, I'm excited to try this out with him because um, He's such a smart little kid and I'm really into like the Montessori toys versus just like the things that always like flash lights at you and stuff like kind of like them learning how to do things. So um, yeah, I'm really excited for this and it was on sale. So that's always good. And then we're going up north for our family reunion. So I figured I needed to get him some, um, what do they even call these? Like, disposable swim diapers so just these are nice because the other ones like if you use their normal diapers they just kind of like swell up and all the material the cloth gets all everywhere so excited to try these out um it only came in a pack of like oh, i guess 18 so that's not bad oh i got some cornhole things um this is kind of heavy but we were terrible and we left the cornhole bags out outside over winter and everything so they are just look they're disintegrating basically so i definitely need to get better at remembering to pull certain things out from the yard in the winter so these are on sale too and i like them because they're like the american flag um stripes and then the stars i just thought they were cool um so this we're gonna have this set out we're gonna have this set out at his first birthday for like things for the adults and the older kids to do. Um, and then this, I hope this is the right size, but this specific shower mat, my mom got these and oh my gosh, you guys, seriously, these are the most comfortable thing on your feet and they're a lot, a lot better than the plastic ones that I've gotten, even just for slip resistance or whatever um i love these a lot i can link down below this i really need to do like a ltk or whatever but um these are amazing highly recommend these they come in different colors too good find from my mom and i was like i really need to buy a pair of those because they're very nice and then our friend is having their bridal shower soon so i got them their gift um they're really into cooking and everything so this was on the registry it's like the bamboo knife set thing so i need to wrap this and get this already for them but i'm glad it came today because today's tuesday and i didn't think it was going to come to like the day before their thing so i'm really glad that it came earlier but yeah so i'm probably just going to like wrap that get all this stuff situated and then um probably chill for a second so i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching that's all folks <laughs> give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe